Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geek Cupboard, I'm Penge, and welcome to Acres, which is a farming strategy game where we have a little farm, we grow crops on the farm, we sell those crops on, and then with the money we make, we grow the farm one acre at a time. You see, that's where the name comes from. And as our farm gets bigger, we make more money, we can invest in different crops and farm machinery and fertilizers and all that kind of farmy stuff, with the idea being to see how big we can make our farm, and also whether we can keep it all running and ticking over nicely. Now the game isn't out quite yet, this is a sort of pre-release build type thing and it's not the finished version of the game but of course if you're interested there is a link to the Steam Store page in the video description where you can go and check the game out and also wishlist it if you would like to but anyway time to get on with it I think let's jump in and get farming okay doke here we go welcome to our little farm everyone and when I say little farm I really do mean little farm because that's it that there in front of our very eyes is the full extent of our farm right now there are no hidden fields or barns or warehouses houses or anything else that right there is our entire farm it's not very much is it it's not very big really I wouldn't say it's a farm it's more of a glorified allotment right now but you know what we can turn things around and turn it into a huge big sprawling glorious farm it's all going to be wonderful so what do we have going on down on our little kind of teeny tiny farm we have a lovely red barn I do like that. I like the red barn. Might need a bit of a lick of paint, I would say, to make it even more vibrantly red, but that's okay. And then we have a red tractor, and that's good because, of course, red tractors go faster. Everybody knows that red things move quicker, so that's good. Little kind of bale of hay type thing over there. And then out the back, we have a little kind of storage thing, which is currently holding carrot seeds, and that's it. That's all we have. I don't think there's anything kind of secret hidden around the back or whatever. No, that is all we have right now. So we do need to do some work on this. We need to buy some more land, buy some more acres of land, and then we can you know, get more crops grown and all that kind of stuff. So that's the farm at the moment. What else do we have going on? I mean, right now, very important question we have to ask is spacebar pause. And no, I cannot confirm that Spacebar is pause. Oh, dearie me, game. I don't think you can pause this game. I don't think it can be paused. You can make time go incredibly slowly, which is what we're doing now. We're on one quarter speed. So that's about as good as you can get. But you can't pause a game. But there we go. And we do begin with a very curiously specific amount of 2,218 monies. I'm not quite sure why it's that very particular amount, but there we go. So got a decent amount of money. And then we have reputation over here. There is fuel. We have a limited sort of fuel because we've also got to put fuel into the tractors. And then over here, we have some very important things. These are our orders. So we're not just sort of farming and then selling everything on wholesale. We're not going, hooray, we've got three tons of carrots. We're going to sell three tons of carrots. It's all done in kind of individual units. So that first order that came in, that one there. The one on the left is the sort of the oldest order, I think. That's the first one that came in. They would like 10 carrots and four cabbages. They're gonna make a lovely kind of vegetable stew or something. And then if we do that, if we deliver 10 carrots and four cabbages to that particular person, they're going to give us 840 monies. And then there's another order for 15 carrots. That gives us just over a grand. And that one there is for five cabbages and 18 carrots, but that's gonna give us almost one and a half grand, which is quite a lot of money. So, okay, three orders now. And I think what happens is, when we do grow stuff and harvest it, it kind of goes into here somewhere. There's kind of, you know, a storage area somewhere. And then I think, from when I did the tutorial, because I did do the tutorial just to get an idea of how it sort of vaguely worked and sort of how things fitted together. I think what happens is the older orders, so the orders on the left, are kind of uh, dealt with first. So we can't grow 15 carrots and say, yep, yeah, let's get that middle order out of the way. The 10 carrots, those 15, are going to go to that first order there. So let's get some stuff in the ground, shall we? Let's get planting some carrots and some cabbages. So carrots might be a good start. So here we go. Now what we have to do is, I think we've got this little bit of land here to work with. We kind of go along that way. So our, sort of a, our tractor can go up and down in that direction. I think we save that for putting down more kind of seed stores and everything else over there. So right now, let's get all that done. So firstly, we have to go and do this. We've got to plow the ground, of course. Now we could spend a thousand of our monies on getting a single row plow implement, which I think is a thing that we can attach onto the back of the tractor, and then it can go up and down and it can do some plowing. Otherwise, we have to do it by hand. And that could take a little while, and I think it costs a tiny bit of money. So we might as well invest in that, I think. Let's get that done right now. I mean, is it a good idea to do it so early? 
I'm not entirely sure, but we're going to get it done. So let's have that, please. And then, yeah, look, we can see there's a kind of a tractor outline type thing. So if we put that, um, hang on, how do we turn it round? How do we turn that round? Uh, there was a button to turn it around like that. Look. So if we put that, say, there, that is now going to come along and it's got that kind of big thing on the back, that whatever it is, cultivator plowing type thing, the farmy thing, look, and it's going to come all the way down here and it's going to plow that row there. But at the moment, it can only do one row. It can't do two rows. It's doing the one row and it's missed off the starting bit. OK, we don't want to do that bit anyway. That bit can stay there. So I think we might have to move time on a teeny tiny bit quicker because otherwise we're never going to get done. Right. So they're now doing some plowing. Then we need to do some planting. But yeah, we can't afford that right now. We can't afford 3,350 monies on a seeding device at the back of the tractor. So we might have to go and do this manually, I suspect. Let's let you get all the way down here first, shall we? Continue plowing, good old tractor friend. Okay, there we go. The tractor's now back in the barn. It finished its job of doing that one kind of row of plowing. Bar that little square there, I'm not quite sure. I suspect maybe I misclicked or something, but there's one square there which avoided being plowed, but plenty of others to work with. So now, yeah, we do need to actually get some seeds into the ground. So we would like some carrot seeds, please. Let's get that done right now. So we can go boop, 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 and then they can just grow. The carrots will just grow. So how about we do that? Oh, hang on. Seed store. Oh, the seed store is empty. Okay, we've gone through all of the carrot seeds, but that will grow a lot of carrots, which is a good thing. However, we do also need to get some cabbages. So I think what we have to do is you have to go to here and where is a seed, so a seed bin. Okay, so can we get one of those, but for some cabbages? That's gonna cost 369 monies, but I think we have to get it in to start meeting our orders. So pop that just there. Okay, so now we have 24 cabbage seeds. So I think what we do is we then go to the planters and we say, OK, got carrots there. Let's put cabbages over here. So I think, is it six per square? Yeah, so put one there and one there. OK, so now I think we've got, what's that? Yeah, so 24 cabbages growing there and 24 carrots growing just there. Okie doke. And now we need to sort of take care of things. We've got to take care. So weeds might grow. We have to sort of get rid of them with a manual cultivator. I think where it says manual cultivator, I'm fairly certain that's just us, that you know, we are the manual cultivator. We're a person going out with some sort of, you know, I don't know, pruners or garden shears or something, and we're going to go and do the weeding. And then, of course, as well, we have to water things too. So how about we give them a spot of water right now? Let's just go and water all the things, because that makes sense. Now, everything does cost a bit of money. Things are costing some money. However, it's raining. Does that help with the watering? Should we have bothered with the watering because it is raining quite a lot? Was that a thing we didn't need to do? Okay, move time on a bit quicker. Let's see what happens. So are weeds now going to pop up in these spaces here? And if they are, we're going to have to get rid of them with a bit of whatever it is, manual cultivating. So let's keep an eye on things. Can we see how near they are to grow? Yes, we can see. So down the bottom right, we can see how close they are to actually being a fully grown thing. So I think they've gone through one phase. Now they're in the second growing phase. They've only got three growing phases, but it looks like nature is trying to reclaim those. Hang on a second. I think we have to do this. So manual cultivate. Yeah. OK, we have to go and do that. So we're going to keep the weeds off of them. Um, that square there's got nothing in. So we might as well not bother with that one, but that's OK. Right. How are they looking? Carrots on two out of four. Cabbages, though, looking pretty good. Two out of three. OK, runtime on pretty quick. Let's just get this done, show. So the carrots are slowly growing. Cabbages are going to come through. They are entering their third and final phase. It looks like they've both got plenty of water, which is good. Oh, hang on, hang on. Slow time right down. I think the cabbages are done. I think they're done, are they? They're ready. It says ready. OK, well, hang on. So now we go and harvest them. But again, manual harvest. It's us going out to kind of pluck them out of the ground. So we'll have that and we'll have that. We'll have that. And we will have that. So in terms of the orders that have been met by those cabbages, we've got how many cabbages do we have in storage? I'm not quite sure how many we've got sort of scurried away in there, but oh no, 24. So we have 24 cabbages in storage, but four are going to go toward that order and five are going to that order. So now we need the carrots. Hang on a second. Go and just sort of do some weeding over there, please. There we go. How are we looking? So they're on their third 
out of their fourth phase. So I assume phase four is, you know, we're ready to be harvested. And if you leave it much longer, they go a bit kind of, you know, sort of icky in the ground. They go a bit moldy, do they? I'm not really sure. Uh, okay, weather's changing, day-night cycle. And there we go. They're now ready. So we can harvest that. So that's going to be six carrots. Okay, so six goes in. And those six have gone to that first order there. So if we do this, if we harvest another six, that order's complete and we get paid. And now that's going to be... Ooh, Hang on. How many have we got? Eight out of 15. Oh no. Okay. We might, we need, we need one more carrot. Okay. That's a bit of a nuisance. Never mind. Uh, there are 14 in storage because they're just that. Oh, okay. Hang on a minute. Hang on. Now things are being mixed up here. So that person needs a carrot. They need a lot of carrots. And now down here, the cabbage has been met for that new order, but they need corn. They need corn and also a load of carrots. Yeah, we might need to do some work on this. So let's just go and manually plow that entire row there and just get it nice and ready for planting. Okay, that entire row is ready. However, how do we get some more seeds? Because we need more carrot seeds. Um, I know we've got 24 carrot seeds. They must top up every so often, I assume. Okay, that's fine. Right, so let's put the carrots down here. So one, two, three. That's another 24 carrots. Oh no, hang on. That's, is that cabbages or is that carrots? What did I just plant? I might have planted a load of cabbages. Um, that is possibly carrots. Seed storage empty. Hang on, are they both empty? Um, yeah, they're both empty. Okay, I suspect maybe we've got a mixture of... Uh, yeah, that's cabbages. I've planted some more cabbages. Okay, we didn't really need more of those, but you know what? it's okay. It's fine. We'll have more of those. Um, okay, so now we need to kind of wait again. I think we just need to move time on pretty quickly and then get these carrots grown because then that completes that order. And that's quite a lot of money. That grand is quite a chunk of money. So yeah, let's get time ticking on until these are ready to harvest. Okay, so the cabbages are now ready to be harvested. So we'll have those. So one and two and three and four. So now I think we've got an awful lot of cabbages. So hopefully people are going to put loads of cabbages on their orders because I do believe they go a bit off. They go a little bit moldy if they're there for too long. However... Have we topped back up on carrot seeds? Yes, we have. I wonder if it's worth having a good... Hang on. It says plus 20... Oh! Oh, hang on. Hang on. How do, how do we get more of these? How do we get more carrot seeds? I want to know how to get more carrot seeds. Is there a shop? Or when these are done, do we then get some more? Because now we appear to have 24 cabbage seeds again. Maybe we upgrade that for 580 of our monies, but that gives us more carrots because we have got a lot of carrot demand going on. Carrots are very in right now. They're a very vogue vegetable. So can we upgrade that? Cell blocked. I don't, how do we, how do we upgrade a thing? I don't, oh, I think you right click. I think we just upgraded that. Okay, so now I've got another 24 carrot seeds. So let's, hang on a minute. Let's go down to here and plant. Can we do that? plant some more. Of oh, hang on. The ground isn't ready. They've got, it's got weeds on it. Okay, right. We can sort this. This is fine. So carrots, because we need loads more carrots now. There we go. Those ones are possibly getting a little bit kind of, a little bit bothered by the weeds. Right. Three out of four they're on. So hopefully we haven't had to water these either. I think it's okay. It's not too sort of boiling hot or whatever. So I think we're going to be okay in terms of water. There is a little kind of water meter on the bottom right there that we can see. Okay, they are now ready. And there they go. They kind of boop out the ground. Hello, carrots. Okay, bit of work to do over here. So clear those. And these can be harvested. And we'll start meeting some of our goals. They are getting a bit impatient for their carrots. They really want to make their lovely kind of carrot soup or whatever. So there you go. You have that one. And then we need... Oh, crikey, we need loads more. So one and two and three. That means an meets another order. But now we've got a requirement for corn. Okay, so cabbages are looking good for the next two orders. But yeah, cor uh, corn and carrots not looking so good. Cabbage is good for the next three orders. Good grief. But yeah, we need more cabbages and corn now. Okay, this is going to be fine. So go into here um, and yeah, seed bin, corn. Let's get us a corn seed bin. Okay, so now we've got one of those. So that can hold, what can it hold? It can hold, is it just a regular amount? Uh, oh, 36. That can hold 36 of those things. Okay, that's fine. Right, so if we then manually plow these for now, 
I think that'll be okay. Right, so that's us. Oh no, they want they want onions. I think that's an onion. Oh crikey. Okay, right. Many specific requests are coming through. I think we go and plant a load more carrots because they are very much in demand. And then is it worth hang on, hang on. Um manual cultivator, use cost one, rows one. Yeah, the manual hang on, no, we need to that's what I was looking at. Plowing. Yeah, let's just plow this row as well. Let's get all that done. I think we need to plant everything. I think all the things we have need to be planted. So we've got loads of corn. So, um, yeah, okay. Ooh, but, ah, right, I see. We can fit nine corn plants on one square, but only six cabbages and six carrots. Okay, I see. So now we're out of those but everything else is growing. We shouldn't have possibly bothered doing those ones, but never mind, never mind. We'll check if they start topping back up, because if they do, we'll immediately plant them, because it's a big sort of supply chain now. We just need to keep things going. Got to keep farming. People need their veggies. It's good for them. It's healthy. Right, so run time on quick. This is going to be glorious, and then maybe we can start updating things a bit. We can start buying new exciting sort of gadgets. We can upgrade the tractors and things. That'd be quite nice. Right, keep that all clear. How are we looking for seeds? Still not got any more. I'm not going to put more cabbages in, I don't think. The next four orders are sorted for cabbages. We're okay. The cabbages are looking pretty good, everybody. Reputation is looking okay. We've completed three orders. Yeah, okay. Pretty happy with that. That's quite good. Just uh, do some weeding over there. That's very nice as well. Okay, keep time ticking on. How long until they're done? They're nearly done. The corn is pretty much done. Oh, and the carrots are nearly done as well. Those first lots of carrots are almost done. Hang on. They need a bit of weeding, I think. Okay, right, let's get these ones done. So those carrots are ready. So harvest you, that should meet... Hang on a minute. Eventually, it'll meet that goal there. Okay, so boop and boop. Right, so now... These two goals are complete in terms of cabbages and carrots, but not corn. But the corn is almost there, I think. The corn is pretty much done. Right, cultivate those four bits, um, or plough it, sorry, and then get the carrots back in immediately because we still need a lot more carrots to complete that goal. 29 to complete that goal. Good grief. Okay, uh, corn is almost done. Those carrots are going to be coming through. This is wonderful. Um... Yeah, okay, we just need to kind of hurry time on a bit, but money is looking okay. Money's looking pretty good. And when we cash these in, when we get all these in, that's going to be even better. Do we want to think about maybe getting those onions in? Do we want to think about maybe doing that? Is it worth getting a little kind of onion store bin thingamajig in? Um, yeah, can we do that? Can we say seed bin for onions? Just put an onion seed bin in. And then we can grow those as well. Ah, right, hang on a second. The corn is done. So that'll meet that goal. That's 1,351 money coming our way. And then, oh, hang on a minute. Loads of the other orders completed. Oh, do you get a lot of yield out of that? Do you get a lot of corn out of that? Oh, okay, right. So now we've got loads of corn um, and we don't need it anymore. Carrots and onions are the way forward. Oh, crikey, it's okay. Right, hang on a second. So, onions here. Oh, now we need to cultivate or plough, whatever it is. Right, blah, blah, blah. There we go. So, uh, onions, please. Do we fit a lot of onions in? Yes, we do. Okay, so four lots of onions. Well, four plots of onions going in. Four acres? Is that right? I don't know. Hang on. They're not growing because we've got to go and sort that out. Um, yes, yeah, so that'll get onions. Then we'll have carrots. What's that thing? I don't know what that thing is. Uh, a beetroot, possibly? I'm not entirely sure. Um, I mean, right now... Oh, corn. Again, good. Uh, can we swap around these things? Can we say... Like, is that always one of those? Cell blocked. Okay, hang on. Can we change... What's in one of those? Tractor barn, water gauge, tractor control device, and then remove things. Oh, I was going to say we could change that corn one and make it someone else, make it another thing. Still another type of seed, but now we need some corn again. Okay, uh, right. Okay, so do all that. I kind of feel like I need to be automating this a bit more. I need to be doing more automation, like doing that thing. Single row plow implement. It costs one, and it can do the entire row. Uh, although... Is it worth investing in a bit of new land? We've just got over seven grand. We could buy another row over here. 
You have to buy it bit by bit, but that's okay. I think that might be worth doing. It's not even that expensive. <gasps> We've expanded the farm. The allotment has grown. Okay, now I think we use the tractor to go like that. Okay, so that can plow all of that. That costs one. So I've been wasting a load of money really on doing all this kind of other work. Okay, manual harvest. So grab all these. So that's got us a load of carrots. So I think one of those orders is done. Um, I think, yeah, well, oh crikey, there are so many things. <laughs> I could never be a farmer, I'd be useless. Right, okay, so they're all growing. Everything's all tidy over there, that's all good. Um, and then really, we want you to do those as well. Uh, hang on a minute, we'll just do some tidying up of the weeds over there. We want you to kind of do that row as well. I will, uh, hang on a second, where are you? So there, so from there onwards, I think, please don't squish all the onions. Don't squish those. But okay, that's good. Um, and then, I mean, is it worth just doing the same again from there? We haven't got another tractor, but I think. Did I see a tractor barn? Yeah, tractor barn. Um, okay, is it worth popping one of these down somewhere? Do we buy some more? Hang on, let's buy some more land over here, look. We'll buy a bit of land. Um, is that enough for a tractor barn? Uh, yes, it is. Perfect. Okay, we've got another tractor now. So now we can have two tractors going around doing tractory things at the same time. So now you can go there so they can sort that out. Um, and then we'll have corn. So put loads of corn along there. And then we'll have carrots like that. Um, and then, yeah, cabbages are now coming back. They're becoming popular again. Okay, right, this is fine. Um, okay, maybe though, do we now spend some money on upgrading these? And I think, yeah, right click to upgrade. So, okay, hold more seeds. Hold more seeds, hold more seeds. So now we can put down even more things. So more corn can go in and potentially more onions. So we can get a lot more things in. Right, that's good. However, now we might want to do some automatic weeding. That's 6,900. We can't afford that right now. That's a bit of a nuisance. Okay, so we have to do that manually. Um, which is just a bit of a nuisance. It's just a bit of a bother, isn't it? You have to kind of click and do stuff, but okay. Have we got any other seeds? Anything else we could plant? Cabbages. And we are going to go through a few cabbages, actually. So let's get that done. So a few cabbages over there. And that's looking wonderful. Um, everything. The water thing's down here, by the way. The little kind of water limit. Uh, it's looking good. It's looking good. There's plenty of water. I mean, there are some complicated things over there. There's a soil pH balance and an M value, an NPK Casa Mug. I don't know what they are. I don't know what they are, but Joe, it's all fine. I'm not too worried. Right, manually harvest. How much does that cost? Um, oh, it doesn't cost anything, but of course it's just a bit of a fiddly bother, isn't it? Right, okay, so onions are now looking good for the next two orders, and we've got a bit left over. So now again, we're back to cabbages and carrots. Carrots are the thing. Carrots are just the thing that we need loads of. But um, yeah, we can't put any more down. Is it worth? Can we upgrade the carrot store again? 1,200. I think we do it. I think we do it. More carrots. More carrots for everybody. Um, okay, hang on. We'll just do that automatically. Uh, no, not automatically. We'll do it ourselves. Um, cultivating. Need to go and do some weeding. Yeah, it'd be easy if you could just go, do you know what? Yeah, uh, tractor, go and do the job, please because it's a bit fiddly having to click on everything all the time. But yeah, we'll just do that. Look. Um, okay, we were planting more carrots. So carrots, 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 carrots down there. Got 24 more that we could do. So how about we expand down here a bit with our huge amounts of cash that we now have. Those are ready to come out the ground. Let's go and meet a few goals, hopefully. Not quite as much as I would have liked, but okay. And they're now ready. Okay, so one... And two, still not met that first goal. And there's 25 there and 18 there, good grief. Okay, right, hang on. So do some plowing here, because that's nice and easy. Get that done. And then more carrots. All of the carrots going in. There we go. Still got another 12. Two more squares of carrots can be done. Uh, okay, we'll just sort the weeds out again, because they're a nuisance. Uh, right, I think plow those. So plow all that. And then go to here. And we'll have the final two carrots. And then, I mean, what else do we put in? Any more cabbages? 
Is it worth putting them in or some onions? In fact, I've got loads of onions left over, haven't we? Whereas cabbages, we might not have. Yeah, put more cabbages in. Okay, things are looking good. We want a great big kind of payday, really. Oh, no, hang on. I forgot about these things. Um... Beets. Okay, we're going to have to put some beets in at some point. Uh, let's get a beet store. So seed bin for beets. Okay, put that in. So we've now got a little kind of seed store for those. Upgrade that to level two because all the other ones have leveled up as well. It makes sense. Um, yeah, we're now out of cabbages and we need some more carrots. Although those cabbages there are now ready to come out of the ground. So boop, 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 boop. Right. Cabbages looking good until that order. I think we're growing more good grief. Okay, we need the auto, this thing. We need the, um, not the harvester, that one, the row spreader. That, no, not that. Where's the weed killing one? That one there, 6,900 money that would be. But that's going to help loads, just sorting all this out. We can just send the tracks around to do the weeding rather than us having to click and miss things. Right, so get rid of that. All those have got weeds on a thing. Oh, dearie me. Weeds, weeds, weeds. Right, they're ready to harvest. These have got weeds on as well. Uh, okay, if we're ready to harvest, so grab, 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 grab. We did just meet one order there. Um, we've just, oh, hang on, there's loads of things over here. Right, that's more cabbages, is it? Um, the marker things are still there. They'll go away in a bit, it's fine. Another order comes, oh, we're back to classics, back to the originals. Okay, right, these are now ready to harvest. So more onions was that? That's plenty of onions, I think. That's that's so much in the way of onion. Okay, so this is good. Um, I think, yeah, we need more carrots. Carrots are just, they're just very in right now. So hang on, let's just do that stuff. 5,500. Yeah, if we could get enough carrots in to do that order, that's 2,000. That's 3,000. Oh yeah, beets. Let's get some beets in. Uh, let's go, uh, yeah, down here, look. No, we haven't done the we haven't done the ground. Hang on a second. Start just there. Cultivate that. And in fact, get the other tractor in to cultivate that. Yes. There we go. Yay for tractors. Okay, speed time on a bit. Uh one tractor is significantly Oh, there you go. <laughs> they had a bit of a race there. Okay, that's fine. Uh right, get rid of the weeds. That thing's gonna be really useful. Right. Uh beets. Beets are what we want. So one, two, three, four, five, six. We can store many beets, it seems. Uh, and then we're going to need just even more carrots. Okay, do you know what? Upgrade the carrot bin. Give us all the carrots you can cope with, game. All the carrots all the time. Some carrots are coming through there, which is good. Uh, we will do that and that there. And we'll do that along there. Look, that's fine. Because that means we can quickly... Get some more carrots in. Yay. Right, okay. All the carrots, please. So I've got 24 seeds left. We can just carry on carroting after this. It's going to be perfect. Um, and then we need to harvest. So harvest carrots along here. Is that going to allow us to meet any orders? It met an order somewhere because we're on six grand, but it didn't meet that order there. Uh, right, they are cabbages. We shall have those. Um, yep, yeah, do the ploughing. Does it destroy anything past it? Or do they know to plough the empty squares and ignore the ones that are already ploughed? I'd like to the game is clever enough to sort of realise that we don't want to trash the things that are already in the ground. Okay, right. Let's get these done. Let's try and get a decent amount of money. I'd like to be able to buy a few little kind of upgradey bits and bobs. Like that. Look, I'd like to get all these kind of things done. So let's just see if we can get over maybe 10 grand. I mean, our reputation is pretty good. So let's just tick time on a bit and try and make 10,000 monies. Okay, my goal to get over 10,000 monies has been thwarted a little bit because I just accidentally spent a great big pile of money on an automatic seeding thing, a single row seeder. I thought we were clicking on that thing. I thought we had the plow selected, not the planters. So I clicked on that and it doesn't say, are you sure you want to unlock this thing? It just goes, yeah, absolutely. You've unlocked a new thing. So we now do have a single row seeder which is quite good. That's a good thing. But right now we can't use it. That's okay though. We'll use that at some point. Um, yeah, so we're a little further away from 10 grand than I would like, which is a bit of a shame. But we have so many carrots coming through now. So many lovely carrots. So here we go. Let's go and harvest all of these. So that order's going to be done. That order's, I think, going to have plenty of carrots in, which is absolutely marvellous. So there we go. That's got carrots. I've got some carrots going there. There are more carrots growing. 
So yeah, we're going to need... What do we need? Beets are growing there, but they seem to take quite a long time. They're almost through, though. So hopefully that'll cover that and that. That order's done. Then we need cabbages and carrots again. Hang on. There's some more, uh, some more carrots there. Yay! Okay. So cabbages, carrots and beets are now the order of the day. Okay, right. Hang on then. So if we can clear that out of bees, I'd like to use our automatic planter thing because I just kind of inadvertently spent loads of money on it. So it would be quite good if we could get that in. Um, in terms of everything else, uh, corn we've got in reserve. Yeah, okay, cabbages. We're going to need some of these. So hang on a second. Let's get you two, two tractors, to just sort those bits of soil out. So just, you know, plough those, please. That's going to be helpful. And then cabbages. That's what we want. So cabbage, 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 cabbage cabbage okay hang on you're plowing stop stop okay right they're they're destroying okay so when you plow things it destroys the entire row okay these these are things i've learned uh, this is this is how farming works everybody okay don't do that again then <laughs> right that might also impact our ability to get to 10 grand destroying all the crops that we've just spent ages growing okay that wasn't our finest moment on the farm, but you know what? It's okay. It will do. Now everything's in rows. Maybe that's what we have to do, really. Maybe we have to get things all set up in rows. So hang on. If we go to... Ma yeah, right. Destroy that and destroy that. They're cabbages. And then let's get this out of the ground. So put time on nice and slow. Right, so grab all these. Okay, so that is now a huge amount of beets. Okay, so now I've got three rows left. Uh, there's cabbages in there, so get another thing here. You can work on that, please, but it's going slow because time is going slow. They'll clear that row, and now we've got this single row cedar thing. So why don't we just use the tractor to have that entire row seeded with carrots? Because we still need a lot of carrots. And then, as soon as that's done, if we speed time on, anytime you like, you two... Uh, yeah, I was going to say, you can't be going that slowly, you sure? <laughs> that's, that's the slowest thing I've ever seen. There we go, wonderful. Right, so that's that sorted. So there's carrots in that one. We now need... Oh, okay, hang on, hang on. We've got, we've got 14 grand. Right, can we now buy the single row cultivator? Because everything looks a bit sort of weedy around here. So now we've bought that. So now we can do that again, can we? So if we go like that and that... They're then going to get rid of the weeds down here. So we need to do things in rows. So before, when we were pottering about ourselves doing all the kind of stuff, it was fine. But now we've got the tractors working on things. We've got to do it all in lovely straight lines. Right. Okay. That's fine. I'm okay with that. So we've got, yeah, need some more cabbages coming through. So if we manually plant these for now, just go, yeah, one, two, three, and just wait for the last one. And four. Okay, that's good. And these ones are ready to come through already. So yeah, we'll have that. We'll have that. We'll have that. And we will manually plough these just there. And we'll leave that empty for now. That's fine. In fact, does that mean we get more seeds back? Um, yeah, we do. So we'll just go cabbage, 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 cabbage. That'll be a load of cabbages. Okay, so plenty of cabbages. A massive row of carrots is now in, which is wonderful. Um... Onions and beets. Oh, what's that? Sunflowers. Okay, we need some sunflowers in now, everybody. Oh, crikey, it's okay. Um, so the single row cultivator is in. We've not had any problems with watering just yet, so that's okay. But would a row harvester be quite useful? Although it is relatively expensive compared to the money we've got right now, which is a bit of a shame. What other buildings are there? A water gauge. Okay, we don't need that right now, I don't think. Tractor control device. Toggle between stop, move to next. Row. Oh, so you can kind of move the tractors around a little bit easier. Oh, that's quite fun. Or get another tractor. Um, I mean, we could, we could get another tractor. We could just build some more. You know what? We're going to do that. I've got three rows. Let's have three tractors. That I've just built a thing just there. That's on its own. That's it. That's planning. We've got that in just in case. Um, okay, so yeah, get another tractor barn. Pop that in like that. They're relatively expensive. But okay, never mind. Um, and then, right, so plants. Cabbage is there. So now we need, I think, another row. I would say for, say, things like beets and then onions. 
So for each type, we need a whole different row, I would say. Can we just sort of draw it along? No, we have to click individually, which is a bit fiddly, but there we go. Right, okay. And then another row for something else. Uh, we've got three tractors that can now go and do stuff. So tractor number one, you go and deal with that, please. So you go and sort that out. And then we need to do some weeding along these ones by the look of it. So you two go and do some weeding over there. That's going to be helpful. And yeah, make sure we don't send them to you know, plough where the things are. Let's get them weeding where the stuff is already growing and don't destroy all our crops like we did a bit earlier. But yeah, in terms of all these demands, I think we're going to be okay. I think we're going to be fine. One tractor is significantly quicker than the others. Um, I don't think we have to buy any fuel. I think fuel is looking okay. I mean, what if we just press 10? What if we press 10? How much money is that? Oh, hardly any money. Oh, that's fine. No, fuel is okay for the minute. The tractors are looking pretty good. Uh, right, soon enough, we could harvest those cabbages. But now we want to plow that and plow that. And along here, can we auto seed some onions, please? Can we do onions along there? That's going to be wonderful. Um, hang on a minute to do some harvesting. Harvest, 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 harvest. Oh, they're all coming through. They're all coming through. This is wonderful. Okay, it makes it a bit better when you try to automate things. It yeah, goes from little kind of hands-on allotment simulator to big old kind of farm simulator type thing, which is fine. That's what it's supposed to do. So we do need more carrots. They're still growing. So I think that's now cultivated. We need one of these tractors to finish. Okay, that's good. Then they can go and plow that row with nothing in. And then we've got a row of, hang on, what's along there now? That's onions. That's nothing. That's carrots. And then two more rows of nothing. So how about we have beets over there and then we've got onions growing. I mean, yeah, we are going to need sunflowers eventually, but not right now. Maybe some corn. Do some corn over there. Right, okay, there are some weeds appearing. Got to go and do some weeding, you lot, as well, but that's still good. I assume if we upgrade this thing, it's a, yeah, three-row cultivator is 17 grand. So, yeah, the more you play and the more you get done, you can unlock better tools to then allow you to you know, do things easier and get even more money in the long run. Okay, but right now we can't do that, so... We want to cultivate. Be careful that that's the right one. Um, oh, okay. Don't bother cultivating the carrots because they're all pretty much done. Uh, okay, how much have we got in reserve? How much stuff have we actually got? Like, how can we see our thing, storage? Uh, okay, okay, right. So we are lacking in, yeah, onions and beets. We've got corn growing there, beets. Carrots are coming through. Onions are over there. Um... Okay, okay, fine. Things are looking, things are looking pretty good. I'm not quite sure what to put on that row there. Do you know what? Carrots seem quite popular. So let's pop another row of carrots in over there, please. Get those in. And we can harvest all of these. Now, can we do an automatic harvest? 7,100. No, we can't. Okay, that's a bit of a nuisance. Okay, but do you know what? Harvest all of these. This is brilliant. That's so many carrots. Although they want 90. They're going to give us 8,000 monies. Eight grand, nine grand nearly. Okay, right. We have to make them happy. We have to make sure that that person leaves a very happy customer. Okay, we have a lot of things to harvest. It's a shame we can't actually buy the automatic harvester thing because that would have made life a bit easier, but never mind. So we're going to grab all of these. So that's a load of onions from over there. Then we've got beets down here, which I think is, yeah, it's going to complete that part of their order. And the amount of beets are just going to roll on. Look at that. We've got loads of orders completed of beets. And... We've got 79 left over. And then, right, okay. That was an order with corn in it. That must have been paid out. That's pretty good. Uh, okay, right. So we're now looking a bit empty again. However, I do notice that's looking like it's got a few weeds on it. So they're two cultivator jobs. So they can go and get rid of the weeds. And then over here, we will plow that. And um, yeah, those are two rows of carrots going in. But yeah, we are going to need to get sunflowers in soon. So that's going to be carrots to complete that. Carrots to complete that. Also some onions. Okay, carrots and onions and sunflowers. They're the things we need. Okay, right, that's fine. Run time on quick. We'll have a row of carrots across that side. We've almost got 10,000 monies as well. So hang on. Can we upgrade the onion store? 
so we can have a few more onions. Okay, so yeah, put onions into that row there, please. So that can all be onions. And then we've got these two rows here. So I think then let's get the sunflower orders delivered as well. That's going to be quite good. So go to here, have a seed bin with sunflowers, pop that in and then just upgrade that a couple of times. There we go. So it's as good as all the other ones. Right, we need to do some weeding. In fact, you know what? Just plow those again. Plow those again. There's nothing in those that we are sort of scared of losing. It's just you know, grass and weed. So that's all fine. Right, get rid of all the nonsense and we'll put down some lovely, lovely, happy sunflowers. Okay, they're both clear. Let's get some sunflowers in. So sunflowers on there, sunflowers on there. However, we really do need that. We could do with 17 grand for a three row cultivator because now these weeds are popping up all over the place and we can do one row at a time, which is okay. It's better than doing no rows, but it does take a long time, particularly when the other tractors are doing something else. So that is a bit of a nuisance, but okay, right. Get time ticking on nice and quick. They finished planting all of the sunflowers. I don't think it's quite gone to the end over there, but that's fine. Yeah, look, there are so many weeds. There are so many weeds. Okay, right, everybody, go on a bit of a um, a weed killing drive, please, because there are a lot of weeds everywhere. Hang on a second, the sunflowers are already done. Are they done already? Oh, they grow very, very quickly. Okay, we should be able to complete quite a lot of orders here. I'm hoping our money is going to fly up in a second. So these are carrots, and that's going toward the big goal, the big payday, and boop. Uh, is that done? 90 seconds. Okay, one more carrot for you. There you go. Uh, right, they want sunflowers. That's that done. They want some sunflowers as well. That one's all sorted for sunflowers. These want sunflowers. Got loads of sunflowers coming through. Don't you worry. We've got a massive, massive supply of them. Possibly slightly too many, but that's fine. Then we've got more carrots, but they want 82 of them. So that's good that we're stocking up on these because they're going to go immediately back out on that big order. And then we've got onions along here. So hang on, grab all of those. The auto harvester would be useful for that, but there we go. Right, so some beets and, oh, what's that? A green thing. I don't know what that green thing is. Okay, hang on a minute. There are many orders. Slow time down, slow time down. We need to do some plowing around here. Um, can't afford that. So here we go. Let's just do three individual plows just to clear that out. And then we'll put in some beets some more carrots possibly. Um, and then, yeah, we'll have a row of whatever those green things are. What are those green things? Uh, that is lettuce. Of course it is. Okay, let's get a little kind of lettuce store thing. So put that over there and upgrade that. Um, are they all upgraded properly? Are they all upgraded to the right level? Level four, level two. Hang on, hang on. I kind of feel like we should upgrade our things to at least all level three. Yeah, there we go. The carrot's got level four. We always need loads of carrots. Okay, right. That's going to take forever if we leave it at quarter speed. Hang on. Come on, you lot. Come on. It's time for Formula Tractor. Come on, do a bit of a race, you lot. Or or just go painfully slowly. Come on, put your foot down. <laughs> right, there we go. That tractor's roaring into the lead. Excellent. I mean, look, it's all weedy by the time you finish. You took that long. Right, so then sort out um that and that as well so you two get those done um i will just go and um de-weed that i'll just do i'll do all this myself that's fine don't you worry you lot right and then one track to, yeah beats okay so beats get that going into there and then lettuce put in no track oh there's no track though of course there isn't hang on run time on nice and quick again let's get this done and we'll just fill the entire farm up with many, many exciting things. Right, so that was beets. Then we want lettuce. Potentially quite a lot of lettuce. So put two rows down there. Then we're going to need more carrots to complete these goals. Uh, some flowers are looking good for a long time, up to that order there. Um, and then we want more beets and then possibly some more onions. Okay, so when those tractors are done just speed time on a bit one tractor lagging behind uh yeah you go and put down some onions right okay this is good can we afford the the multi-weeding device thing Seventeen thousand and fifty. we're gonna buy it we're gonna buy it because now we can just go right 
please sort out all the weeds across those three bits and it's just going to make life significantly easier. Okay, right, good. You carry on doing that. Carry on doing your weed culling. Okay, hang on, I see a bit of a problem. We ran out of money and now lots of the things are flashing on and off. Is that, does that mean they're getting too, oh yeah, they're going a bit moldy. They've been in the ground too long. Hang on a minute. Hang on, let's just harvest all of these things. Um, yeah, we went through all of our money as well. We burnt through all of our cash, which, um, yeah, which did mean that we didn't have enough money to pay for the fuel. There's no fuel, look. So hang on, we might need to spend a little bit of money on some fuel for the tractors. Sorry, tractors, that's been quite a bit. Look, back to 400. Um, okay, that didn't go entirely according to plan. That wasn't great, but never mind. Right, let's get the tractors back over here, look. Let's, um, oh, they're all weedy now as well. Uh, right, okay, all three of you, Go over there and do some ploughing. Right, we need to get back on it. Although we have got a nice amount of money now, which is pretty good. So let's run time on nice and quick. And let's just try and get 22 grand now. Where did that come from? Okay, I don't know where... Was there an order that just got completed because of stuff we had in stock, possibly? Oh, that's quite good. That is quite good. Right, you two start ploughing from there and there. And then we can just clear out the um, things from here. That's fine. They can be harvested. Boop and boop. Okay, did that complete another order? 28 grand. Oh, this is very good. Can we get over 30 grand? That would be fantastic. Okay, let's give it a go. Okay, a bit of our farm has got red pointy things on it. What does that mean? The carrots are growing. What does that mean, though? Am I supposed to harvest that? They're not growing because... Oh, there's something wrong with the soil. There's some... Hang on. I don't know how to do that. Manual soil amendment. Okay, we're just going to... I'm just going to press that, but I don't know what to do. I, I don't know. I don't know how to manually adjust the soil. This wasn't in the tutorial. Oh, hang on. There's stuff. Um, I don't know how to. What's the problem with it though? The M value isn't enough. I don't know what that means. How do I make the M value? Oh, there you go. The M value is still not enough, but it's no longer got a angry, flashy red thing. Hang on a minute. Oh, there's all pH balance stuff in there. I don't fully get that. Right. So you go and weed that, and then you weed that bit. That'll sort the weeds out with two tractors. That's very good. Um, yeah, I don't know how to... I thought that was just watering, not soil adjustment. Okay, where is that one? The soil there is... Yeah, M is on just nine. How do we... Oh, bone meal. That adds M. Hang on, put a couple of bone meals down. That sorted the M value out. Okay, right, that's good. That's good. Right, okay, yay, we did some sort of clever gardening stuff. Hang on, where did that other tractor go? That other tractor hasn't finished its job. Where's it cleared off to? Why, why is it gone? I thought I told another tractor to go along and do the stuff over here. And it did not. It must have done a bit because that first bit is done. Where did you go, tractor? We only have one job. Just go up and down. Just go up and down the fields doing tractoring. I don't know where you went. Okay, right. That's fine. That's all good. Yeah, we'll just sort of run time on nice and quick. Oh, and the sunflowers are ready. Okay, you get a lot of sunflowers and they're really quick. Can we, with our 26 grand possibly get us as a row harvester so now we can click on that and it'll just harvest those plants for us without us having to click on everything okay this is getting good this is getting very good because now we can just use the tractors to do all of the things for us hooray for the machines uh yeah okay run time on nice and quick let's see what we can do next i mean carrots carrots and onions are the things that we need really sort of a lot of so let's see if we can do that oh no that's gone a bit red okay we're now lacking in n and m on that so i think the bone mill sorts out m so that sorted out a bit of that but now we need n so nitrogen oh hang on garden 248 i'm just going to chuck that on um, is that good I need more N. We need more N. What gives lots of N? Um, I don't know. I really don't know what I'm doing with this. Uh, there. Try a bit of that. Just pop that on. Is, is that sufficient? I don't know. It, it's, it looks good to me. Oh, and harvesting. Hang on a minute. We can use the auto harvester thing. Now that's a cedar. Um, go there. Yeah, harvest all the cabbages, please. Oh, this is wonderful. That tractor there is planting carrots, and those tractors there are harvesting carrots. It's the circle of carrot life. I like that. That's very good. That's going to save us a lot of time, and hopefully we can also start meeting some other orders, because that one is nearly done. Right, now we need... Now we need corn. Okay, right, again. So the cycle continues. We've now got to go and do this. So plenty of carrots are coming up. That's all carrots. Um, I think plow that and plow that's been plowed already. 
So I think with that, we set that to just clear the weeds. I'm fairly certain that is ploughed. Is that ploughed? No. Bother. Okay, that this is a bigger way. So I suppose it's going to get rid of the weeds from those carrots. That might make life a bit easier. Uh, okay, go very quickly, please. Right, oh, yeah, it's not quite not quite what we wanted, but you know what? It could be worse. Right, that and that. Fuel is looking okay. Money's looking wonderful. Right, so over here then, let's get ourselves some corn. So put corn into that one. Corn, no tractor. Of course, there's no tractors available. Could we get, could we get another tractor? Can we get another tractor in? We could get another two tractors potentially, but I think right now, pop a tractor barn in like that. It does block the other one in. They just become one bigger barn. They just have to be careful who's parked where in there. So now we can say, okay, corn. Uh, the corn seeds are running out by the look of it. Uh, however, lettuce. We're going to need some more lettuce, I think. So put some lettuce in and some lettuce and some carrots. There we go. No tractors, but soon there will be. And there we go. And I think as well, can we get another row in like that, which is pretty good. And then we can get another tractor to go and sort that out like that. And then we could put some more carrots in, some more corn. Oh, there's a new thing. There's a new thing. We do need some more sunflowers eventually, but there's a new thing. There's a red thing. Okay, I don't know what the red thing is. We might have to grow some red things at some point. And as well... If we've now got six rows, which we have, it means we could put two of the sort of weed blatting tractor things out at the same time. And it'll just, you know, cover the entire field in quotes. It's not a big field, I suppose it is still a field of sorts. So it'll sort that out as well, which is really good. That's very, very good. Okay, yeah, splendid things are coming together. Sort of okay. We are muddling through quite nicely, I feel. Oh no, we've got more red wibbly things happening. I don't know how to deal with the red wibbly things. Is it worth buying a row spreader? Um, it might be worth buying a five row spreader. Um, that is expensive, but it will sort out lots of problems in the soil all at once. You know what? We're going to spend money. We're going to spend a huge amount of money on an expensive tractor attachment thing. Um, I mean, I don't know what the issue is. Maybe we add bone meal. I, I really don't understand this, but hang on. Slow time down. Can we work out exactly what's happening? So the lettuce is growing, but there's no M, N and P. So what? So N is nitrogen. So that's, uh, yeah, that, that's what we want. That thing. Garden 24816. We want that and we want to put that not there. There, I wanted it down here. Okay, never mind. We possibly have spent a huge amount of money. I didn't want it over there again, but never mind. Right, so let's see what that does. So put that on to relatively quick speed. Uh, what's that going to do exactly? Anything? Are you going to go a bit quicker? Right, so it's going to come along. And is it going to sort out all the... Yeah, okay, it seems to be sorting out the soil issues. I think we might have some dead plants there. I think those ones might be a little bit dead. Okay, never mind. That's a bit of a nuisance, but worse things have happened. Um, yeah, we've got some dead ones. So, okay, we're supposed to take care of the soil a bit more. Okay, like, right, message understood. There's more. Hang on. I think we might need to do that again. Although, it looks like we can possibly go and harvest that entire row there. Oh, crikey, it's okay. <laughs> right. Um, let's go over there again with some of the... Oh, that was bone meal. Okay, we'll go and do this as well. We'll go and put some of that out as well uh, about now, look. There you go, don't worry. Health is coming, potentially. Or, or possibly we're poisoning you. I've got no idea. I don't know how to do for Oh, everything is looking very dead. Oh, there are many dead things. Okay, right. Let's go and harvest what we can. Uh, 42 grand for the harvester. Money not looking so good right now. We'll just go and grab... Uh, yeah, they're all ready to harvest as well. We've got four tractors. Right, grab all the stuff we can. Let's just see what we've got left. Can we make any money from the from the remnants of that sort of uh, farming soil disaster there? Right, okay. It turns out lettuce is quite hard to grow. Most of our lettuce appears to be very, very dead. Although the trusty carrots are looking pretty good. Yay for the carrots. Right, so let's get the carrots out of the ground then. Let's not let them die, because that's going to cover quite a lot of that and that, which is going to be pretty good. Um, and then, I think everyone else, just, yeah, just one, two, three, and four. Oh, no, hang on. There's, that tractor's almost at the top. And boop, there we go. Right, so do ploughing there. And then, can we upgrade to the three-row planter? Yes, we can. 
Okay. What do we do now with a three row? Joe, you know what? We're going to have a one row planter again because we're growing loads of different things. So carrots in that one. And then we're going to go, we're going to go lettuce there. And hopefully it'll survive. Got beets. Right, we need sunflowers and we need corn again. Okay. Oh, this is, isn't going well, is it? There's many, many bad things on there. I don't know what to do with it, game. <laughs> I don't fully understand. Um, imagine I'm not a farmer and I don't know what any of that means. Um, okay. So now, oh, it's not watered. Okay. We can sort that out. That's nice and simple. We can put water in. They're dead already. Oh, crikey. Okay. Right. Lettuce is a pain. I'm sorry. You're going to give us 13 grand if we grow some lettuce, but it might not happen because lettuce is awkward. Away with you pesky lettuce. Nobody really likes you anyway. I think we might have grown some lettuce. Oh, it's a glorious day. Hang on a minute. Hang on. Let's get it now before the ground goes all kind of horrible. So yeah, go and harvest that. I think that is a lot of lettuce. Okay. Get that as well. That's wonderful. Okay. So 25 grand. That's looking good. Right. We need some carrots. They're going to finish that though, which is good. Right, so back we go to doing some cultivating here and then you can go and do some tidying up just there. That's going to be very helpful. I think that's a huge load of carrots ready to harvest as well, which is magnificent. Are they all done? I think they might all be done. So go and grab all the carrots, please. That'll give us money for completing that. It's going to go toward that goal. Oh, that's not quite done because we also need some lettuce for that one. And now we need other things. We need red things. What are the red things? Peppers, I assume. Tomatoes. Okay, right. So grow some tomatoes. Okay, very nice. Um, In terms of what I'd like to do, I'd like to get to about 50 grand. If we get to about 50,000 monies, I'd be quite happy with that. I think that would be quite a good goal to try to strive to get before we wrap things up. So I think, yeah, that's what we'll try to do. Let's just, you know, keep pushing on with these things. Got some kind of easier ones coming in over here, things that we can do already. So you know, carrots, sunflowers and onions, we can do that. So let's just get that done. In fact, you know what? We'll have, are they carrots? That's lettuce. Let's have three rows of carrots, please because we do go through quite a lot of carrots. So there we go. Um, and then we're going to need, yeah, lettuce is coming through. So, uh, yep, yeah, okay, we just carry on. So yeah, I want some sunflowers coming through. So we'll pop some sunflowers coming in. Uh, and then lettuce and onions are done. More onions, possibly. Let's get a row of onions in. Oh, crikey, hang on a minute. Everything's going to go wrong over there again. Uh, let's go and sort that row out and put some expensive garden stuff on it, some fertilizer or whatever. Uh, okay. Oh, it's water. It's water they need. Okay. Hang on. Send another tractor behind with water. Yes. Oh no, they're all dying. They're all dying. Some are dying. Some are dying. Some are not dying. Okay. Lettuce. Uh, lettuce is a real pain. Okay. We don't like you lettuce. You're too troublesome. Although we could potentially harvest some of that lettuce. So let's harvest that bit. Does it just ignore the ones that are dead? I think it does. Okay, so that goal can be done relatively soon, but I think, yeah, the price it because, oh, look at that. We're not going to get it done in time. I don't think the carrots are going to grow in time for that order. Never mind, we can put these stuff from that order into other orders. I'm sure we just take it out of that one and put it into the other one. So our reputation might come down a little bit, but I, that's okay. We've done pretty well so far. So let's get some sunflowers as well. Um, yeah, 50 grand. That's what we're going to try and do. Let's aim high. Let's aim for 50,000 of the monies. And there we go. We now have over 50,000 monies, which is marvellous. 51,344 monies and 10 smaller amounts of monies, which is good. I assume it's in dollars possibly, but whatever the case, we have a fairly good amount of money. So I think what we'll do is we'll wrap things up for now with our little look at takers, because I think we have had a pretty good look at the game to see what it's all about and how it works and that kind of stuff. And I really do quite like this. I do quite like this. It's one of these games where you sort of, you play it and you earn things in the game, you earn your money in the game to help you play the game even better, which means you get even more money, which means you can buy things in the game to help you play even better, which means you earn even more money so you can buy things in the game to make you play even better. And the cycle goes on and on and it's just really quite good. I mean, you could sink many hours into this. You could lose much in the way of time. Let's just make sure that that's all nice and sort of uh, nice and weed free. What we will do is we'll just put some final things in. We'll plant some final things. I think we've got sort of yellow bell pepper type things coming in. So yeah, there you go. Um, we'll have a bin for those and we'll just do an upgrade for that. So there we go. And we'll put a few of those in. That's okay because yeah, they're new and exciting. Uh, people wanting some tomatoes as well. So put those in. Um, and then we need some cabbages. So get those in. 
Uh, more of those peppers, but I think all the seeds are going to go out, aren't they? Onions, that's a thing that people are going to want. So let's put some more of those in, shall we, like that. And... I mean, what else can we put in? Beets. People are going to want some beets as well, like that. And then just a final thing. Just a final thing that we can throw in there. Um, how about some more sunflowers? Just because. Just because we can. Somebody might ask for some. Um, and there we go. Just make sure that's all nice and weed free again. Just go and sort that out. And we'll go and water it all. It is raining right now, so it should be okay. I think the soil should be okay. It should be sort of you know, moist enough again that it's pouring with rain. But there we go. There we go. That's that all sorted. One thing I didn't really go and check at you, but what were the other things? What are the other things that we end up sort of growing? So we did all right. Look, we got almost on that first sort of column of things. So, OK, chili peppers, watermelons. Then we have the good old, you know, good old potato. Love a potato. Broccoli, pumpkin, delicata. I've never heard of that before. Beans, got butternuts, asparagus, white pumpkin, hemp and Italian pumpkins. I never knew there was an Italian variant of a pumpkin, but there we go. I've learned something new today as well. So there we go. There's plenty to do. I mean, yeah, we have got just under 50 grand now, of course, because yeah, we did go and do a few more bits and bobs. But, uh, but uh, yeah, you can go and spend loads. You can buy so many upgrades. You can buy so many tractors. You can get different tractors. You can buy different tractors, I think, if you like. So I think, um, I don't know how you do that exactly. I don't know how you upgrade the tractors. Do you click on the tractor and build the shed? Maybe that, hang on, we're going to try that just to wrap things up. Hang on a second, game. Wait there. We're going to maybe get ourselves a slightly fancier tractor. Um, some of you, it's quite a lot to um, be gathering, actually. Go and do that as well. Well, the four tractors can do that right now. What's going to wrap things up, game? You've distracted me. <laughs> You've distracted me with your tractors. Right, so if we then go to here and say, okay, tractor barn, I'd like, oh, yeah. You can buy different tractors. So you can buy a harvest or cub is the red ones. Then you can buy a national, which is the yellow ones. A tord, which is five grand. A cars, which is ten grand. And a gym buck for twenty grand. Do you know what? We're going to treat ourselves to a gym buck. <laughs> there we go. We've got a fancy tractor. Okay, that's very exciting. I do like that. So it's... Oh, it gets a shift on. Okay. Maybe we should have got ourselves some new tractors earlier because they definitely get a bit of a shift on, don't they? Crikeys. Okay, they're incredibly quick. They're very fast. But I like that about this game. You can just... Yeah, look at the speed difference. You can do all these exciting things. There's just so much stuff to do and so many things to upgrade and different ways around to do things. And there's no right, I would say, or wrong way to play this. Those tractors just, just gave up there, but okay. Um, and you can you can play it as a nice relaxing game, or you can play it as one where you have to put a bit more effort in. You can really try and do your thing if you want to. What? Oh, there's no fuel. Hang on a minute. That's better. Um, but yeah, I, I think we will wrap things up for now. I think we have had a pretty good look at it, but it's been really good. It's been very, very enjoyable. A really interesting take on a farming game. And I've had a thoroughly lovely time. It's been really, really exciting to play. And uh, yeah, we might, as it gets developed... Because, you know, it's still, this is like an early build. As it gets developed, we might pop back to this at some point in the future and just see how it's changed and what they've added and different bits and bobs and, you know, the different way it plays and all that kind of stuff. They might add a few more bits and bobs in that make the game play slightly differently. So, yeah, I think we might well pop back to it at some point in the future when it's a little bit more developed. But I think for now, we will wrap things up with our look at Acres. Hopefully you have enjoyed this. I've had a lovely time playing it, so hopefully you've enjoyed watching. If you have, please do leave a like. That would be most marvellous indeed. And also, if you're not already, then please do subscribe to keep up to date with all the other bits and bobs and nonsense that we get up to in the Geek Cupboard. But for now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard, and I will see you next time. Oh no, not the piggy wigs. want them to be healthy. Happy pigs, please. Raspberries, raspberries, raspberries everywhere. I went through and sold a load of turkeys as well, and they still come back. They're still coming back to haunt me. The storm moisture's coming down. We need rain. We need rain. What's going on? <laughs>